God, we could change we could change builds here. We need two more of those things, by the way. Unlock the sixth one. Uh, I don't know about that. Shoot a volley of flying swords. Sword fairy. So the game's in English, but okay, cancel. No, Mike. No, no, no. When if you see Chinese and it's an option, on the left is option for health, on the right is option for damage. That's all. Some of it didn't make it through to the, the, the final product on the English side of things. Um, localization is a, a huge bitch, especially from uh, Chinese because it's, it's complicated. English is complicated. Yes, cat template. Yep. You know those rooms it says it's spooky or whatever and you have to fight a mimic? Two more mimics and we'll unlock whatever that sixth pillar is. You can't use flicker anymore. I'm game. <laughs> Right, no dashing at all, huh? This should be fairly straightforward. Well, now that we have that... Flying Sword Attack, Defense, Sheath, Cooldown. Oh, it's gonna be a slow run. We need, we need movement speed. It's not exactly a tank build. I mean, we do have double the HP, but... Mortal Fury. Good to me. No, no dashing, so weird. Yeah, we do need the 300. 300, uh, what's that called? What's that? Glass cannon one. Damnation, there you go. What does sheath do? Um, it gives you unlimited usage of your your doobly doos, your your attacks. Um, sorry, going back to what Crow was talking about. Yeah, I, I love that everyone's into it now, doing streaks. And I love that the meta with FTL is you use every single ship, and then you cycle through and you do it again. I, I like that a lot. It's not just completely random, because that means that... Not that this is ultra competitive. It is it is within a select few, I suppose, but it's just nice to see. Like, there's, there's a... It's, even footing, I think the term is. First win was with Indomitable, had a legendary pearl for a shield. Oh, right on. Yep, yep. <laughs> I'm gonna get knocked down a lot. Alright, what's that? Fleet of foot can move at normal speed during rapid fire charged.
That does sound good. But increased max sword meter sounds better. Butcher. If you have damnation, attack boost and defense reduction are traded for a 15% chance for an attack to deal 300. Slightly more damage for our range. What's this? Porter's Spirit. Upon taking a mortal wound, your HP is locked at 10, must use a, a rage skill before effect can be triggered again. Defense. Defense sounds good. Am I going to be streaming FTL anytime soon? Uh, when the update for Multiverse hits. Until then, no. Legendary Relic drop chance. I'll take that instead. Actually. The fuck is that? Oh. That's kind of disappointing. I was like, holy shit, this, this thing's massive. You can only see the... The... What's it called? The guard. What is the sword guard called? Hilt? Hmm. Unacceptable. Bad weapon. Yeah, King Nesta, the first, I'll show you. I'll show you the first upgrade we got. Um, indomitable. Uh, we can't dash. But it doubles our health. <laughs> and now my rage meter is also 50% larger as well. Pagrax, what's up, dude? Forget that I have a, uh, a melee attack too. Huh? Resting after getting your booster, that's good, man. Congrats. We're still waiting on ours. Uh, yeah. Okay. Early February, sometime early February, we'll be getting getting our booster. Almost faster to use melee here. Now, Lovely, let's go. Movement speed, please. I wonder if there's a way to increase movement speed more than just like plus 10. 
Actually, there is. I've seen it. And with relics, too. You can do it with relics. I just love roguelikes. Like, normal is it's ridiculous. Your flying swords can pierce the enemy. Increase damage by 7% for each enemy pierced. That's not how piercing works, but I appreciate it. Or peerless when you're at 100%. If we can get a heal along with that, that would be pretty sick. Do it. Northwind Bloom. Mm. I hate it. Shit. Ripped off, I tells ya. chance to not consume herbal gourd. Increase all healing effects you receive by 60%. That's actually not bad. Pond flicker. Funny. Funny. Using blade movement speed, love it. Let's go. Woo. What's the, what's the shield from? I don't actually know. I don't think it's any of these. Eh. Oh, every common skill we get as well. That's an additional 5% damage. Tortoise. I mean... It's Kinda looks like a turtle shell, doesn't it? Portis McQueed, different. Can't swim. No damage? That was weird.
Cross damage. Shield. Escalation. Upon dealing damage, increase all damage to target by 3.5% for one second. As far as I'm aware, there isn't any set bonuses. Fucking cool though, whatever it is, I love it. Miss Queeb. Fiery Saltpeter. Silver, what's up, man? You doing? Basic Saltpeter. Using herbal gourd produces a healing mist that lasts for 16 blah 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 whatever. I don't think it matters. Grudgingly waking up three ish hours of sleep last night. It's nice. Can't dodge shit. Don't dodge. I don't believe we are one, though. Piece of cake. Sword of Heaven. Flying sword damage. Chance to summon a... Yes! <laughs> yes! Fuck, I love this thing. <laughs> oh. Celestial Jade. Upon dealing damage... No, no, no. 
No. Stephanie P11. How are you? What's going on? You love this flying sword? Or the, the big one? <laughs> it's dumb. It's so good. <laughs> Let's try to get a different weapon, huh? Uh... Hmm. Tiger's Mark. Garbage. Flying sword attack plus 10. 350. Queeb sass leg levels. Oh my god. It's been it's been a night. We have had uh Kenai. How many? Warm snow jokes? Sorry. <laughs> Warm snow references. Jokes are supposed to be funny. We should wait and make more. I mean, <laughs> I, I'm tired. <laughs> I'm really tired. And then the internet dropped, went down. Um, I need router recommendations. Um, I'm, I'm at the end of my rope with my ancient airport extreme. It's not doing what it's supposed to be doing now. Um, Please drop those in Discord if you don't mind. People have told me before this is fucking Lich King looking motherfucker. It's supposed to be very good. And then there's that or like a mesh network, which I don't I don't care. It's gonna cost me a lot either way. Butcher. More blue souls, huh? If you have damnation, attack boosts. Ah, okay, it's the butcher, right. But we lose the damage. Every common skill you have increases your damage. We have what? One, two, three, four. That's 20% more damage. Eh. I don't think we'll stick with it either way. Uh, these ones are my weapon specifically. That is a legendary. So purple. That one is uh, epic, I guess. Orange is legendary. Red is impossible, just like the top tier. And whites are common down the bottom for these. Fuck's sake. Lotus. 
Sex, sex skills are your passives for the run. That sword so much. <laughs> yeah, it's on a cooldown. 100%. Has to be. whole, uh, yeah, the whole, no, no dodging, it's very counter to how I would normally play these types of games. This is correct, thank you, Elemental Silver, yes. Library. Hit me up with some rampage. I deserve it. speed and attack speed. Still not good enough. The last boss is going to suck. Oh yeah. Yeah, hopefully we get some decent upgrades before then.
Piercing Blade might be nice, but I'm going to take many souls here and we're not going to buy anything unless we see potential upgrades, I guess. The soul gain is, what, a hundred and something percent? Yeah, one, one, one fifty ish. Yep. I went the wrong fucking way, didn't I? God damn it! Go back down. I thought I saved it at the last second. I did not. It's all right. Does it tell you how much damage that equals now? Probably doesn't, huh? No, 1.25 for every 50. So we're at 20... Uh, 25. Increase all your damage by... So an extra 25% damage at the moment. Ish. Oh, 47. Two thousand. You're right. Yep. Ah, uh, let's go. Can I have something else, please? Sharpang. Movement speed plus 20%. If you keep moving for 3 seconds, next melee attack deals more damage. All attack plus 25%. Defense plus 12. This over here. Movement speed plus 20. Get rid of the saltpeter. Yeah. No flicker. What do you mean? Oh, did you think I was putting something in agility? The ability to not slow down as well would be very good, I think. Like when you're shooting, that'll let me run around a little bit faster. Oh, imagine if they had... the weapon depth of like a neo in this you know how you can sort of break it apart for components and then upgrade other weapons and stuff would be pretty dope Hon honestly i think the game's too complex already save that for the sequel Elgar. 
Here's the impossible upgrade. Take it or not. One of Golden Book, Legendary Relic, or Impossible Excalibur. Twenty-five percent less damage, though. It's a big hit. skip. I want to know what the golden book is. This should be fine. This fight. I'm going to take some hits though. An orange skill. Really? That's it? Wait, higher than the yellow ones we have? Maybe that's what gold means. Okay. <laughs> Why not just keep the same colors? Ow. Difficulty am I on? Normal. Zero. Yeah, this is gonna suck. Farming red gems, like literally the only thing you can farm. Well, I guess you could be going after uh, lore. This one. And mimics. I need two more mimics. Yep. Majestic. Increases your defense by 33% and make you endure during rapid fire. Whatever the fuck endure means. Unable to be knocked down, perhaps? Alright, I'll take that. Sanchala, 
又来强化了吗？抵达希望的彼岸，准备好了吗？下一站，天机府。What's up, DT? I wonder what the cooldown is. Just a, a worse butcher. Are there any other lore that is specific to a fight or room? Is there any other lore? Three grand. Uh, so what's that? 75% now? Other than the increased duration or the increased meter, which we've already got, there has to be more, um, more in the way of cooldown reduction or cooldown speed up or whatever. Randomly gives you two seconds of really so oh, interesting. It's meh. Mm. Oh, can't dash through shit. You know what? I'm out of here. I'm gonna take the elevator down. Ground floor. Nothing bad ever happens in elevators. Sword God. That's what you were just talking about. Flying sword attacks to trigger Sword God mode so that your sword rain generates no sword meter for two seconds. Ah. Eh. Yeah, whatever. Fine.
Oh yeah, okay. That means you need to do sustained bursts. And I'm sure it has a cooldown as well. It is, that's pretty meh, yeah. Hardly proc for you. So Timo, it's got a it's got a cooldown. Same as the giant sword. It's like can't happen within you know a certain amount of time. Four grand. Double damage. Not good enough. We need more. It, it's fine. Oh! So we don't get knocked down at all if we're shooting. I thought it was only during... Uh, by using recall. Or our special. Okay. It's even better. Now we're, now we're a tank ish kind of weird one but yeah I need the speed up from um I need the thing I need the thing Uh, the when you're shooting you don't slow down Later, Vale. Take it easy. I'm not too far behind you, to be honest. Strange night. <笑>切身带来可口的灵魂了吗 So that has nothing to do with the difficulty. Interesting. 
Yeah, it must be the runes or the symbols around here. What the effect is on the field at the time. Catch these hands. What was the, um, was it a Zelda game? It had hands, and you had to hit the hands. Giant stone hands. Oh, is Mario 64? Waker for sure. It was in Wind Waker. Oh shit. Fifty bucks. Disappointing. Arc light blade. For every six hits with the flying sword, the player shoots six homing blades. Sure. The damage caused by your flying sword will ignore the enemy's fifteen percent defense. Increases true damage by twenty five percent. Hmm. Ocarina of Time. Uh, it's pronounced Ocarina, actually. That one's for you, Miss Queep. Flying sword attack plus 20 for 800. That's worth it. Oh, hold up now. Finally, we're going to the, the final chap. Yes. It's kind of cool. I like it. These numbers do look pretty low, though.
I think it's poison damage. Poison or fire or something, maybe. The wind statue with the laser beam swords? No? Well spotted. Had a pro lot of problems with... So we, we've beaten the third difficulty. The fourth one is... Massive leap up. I think some range builds just aren't... Very friendly late game. Just gonna have to go Casey Jones in there, you know what I'm saying? Get in there. The beam is strong, but you couldn't get past Mr. Tiger Dude with it. Oh, I've never seen this before. little bridge section. It's new to me. Alright, relax. be a mimic. We need two more, right? Yeah, we don't think we're going to get enough on this run. Never say never. Yeah, it's a cool stage. I don't like the fact that there's invisible walls here. Like, I should be able to shoot over there. And is this raised or angled? It does look like there's a shadow, doesn't it? Yeah, it looks like it's raised. Okay. You think it's angled? I think it's poorly drawn, but meant to be raised. The shadow was uh, deeper in the middle section. Almost five grand, 125 percent. Mm. <laughs> Happy? Good. Is that doing no damage there? Better. That would be the opposite of no damage, Quib. Uh-oh. Right, I fucked up. Never mind. Now I fucked up.
Blood Jade. It's the evil eye that I couldn't figure out. Big Bone, why are you so bad? I reckon with a melee build it'd be alright, but... It's, yeah, very, very specific. What's up, teamies? Oh, interesting. Right on. Oh, this is this room. Okay. Any lore here? Negative. I'm disappointed, giant lady. Target is affected by slow, stunned, or paralysis. Flying sword attack plus 30. The flying sword has a 10% chance to deal an additional 100% in flying sword damage when it hits the enemy. yell at me. I don't know, man. Might be close. What's the drink? Root beer? Rare, infinite arhat. Oh, okay, so that belongs only to this. All right, we'll have to pick it up.
你一定会穿越这汹涌的绝望，驱散这。还需要重新注入力量吗？这次可能需要消耗一些灵魂才可以继续。准备好了吗？可以吗？还需要重新注入力量吗？这次可能需要消耗一些灵魂才可以继续，可以吗？你一定会穿越这汹涌的绝望。Yeah, that works. Ow. Is it bad mud? Bad mud studios. <laughs> All right. Short, huh? It's fine. Um, cool. Almost there. Immortal strong. Nah, still missing a few, huh? All right, we'll get them next time. Folks, like I said, that's going to be it for me this evening. Thank you so much for joining me on tonight's stream. Um, let me see here. One sec.